everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of It's Jenkins. So today we've got uh, a mission I want to take. It's a two-skull mission. Should be pretty good. But before we do that, let's have a look at the mech bay because a couple things have changed. So the commando has been, not necessarily decommissioned, but it's been, uh, like all the gear has been removed from it. And we moved all that over into the Panther quick sell. Let's have a quick look at this guy. So it's pretty much the same loadout as we had with the um, commando, but... It's slightly different. So I was able to find, believe it or not, an advanced zoom in the store. So I bought that, which was, I don't know, 200 and, or maybe it was 300,000. I can't, it was a fair bit anyway. Um, so I spent a bit of our coin on that uh, and dropped that in there to give us a little bit better targeting. Uh, we dropped, we were able to drop the, the, uh, the combat shotgun in because we put in the hybrid TSM quick sell. And this time it actually goes in, unlike <laughs> when we tried to do it with the commando. Um, so we've got the Rex laser, the medium pulse, and the small X pulse in here. Hopefully I can round this out with two more uh, medium Rex lasers if I can find those at some point. That's my goal anyway. And in the center torso we've got the Warfare Suite QS. This episode of It's Jenkins is brought to you by Quicksell's Warfare Suite QS. Make sweet, sweet warfare with Warfare Suite QS. So hopefully the Warfare Suite actually does really well in this thing. I'm not exactly sure. I'm, I'm, I'm sure it'll do great. It's not... Um, one of the best, but it's actually got good probe. Um, yeah, and we'll see how it goes. Uh, we definitely needed something in here. Uh, and I also put in the fire control system ballistic because I didn't have any other fire control system to drop in. But it does give us plus two accuracy with ballistics, so I'm hoping that I'm I'm pretty sure it works with a combat shotgun. But uh, we'll see how that goes. Now, the only thing that we have to worry about with this mech is recoil because we've got two recoil on this, and the uh, Rex has got two recoil as well. So, and then a small x has got a couple of points of recoil. So we may have to, you know, spend some time um, dropping recoil. So we'll fire a couple of times and then maneuver to a position where we don't have to fire and, and then come back and rinse and repeat. So that might be uh, a way we have to go with this. So that's this guy. And then I did a refit of the um, Stormcrow because we lost the one side on this. We lost the uh, SRM-10 quick sell unfortunately, but we did pick up all those SRMs. So I did make this into an SRM boat, left the plasma cannon on it, um, put in, uh, I think we had the, the uh, tandem rockets on here before, but I put on the AMS flare. Uh, I was able to get a tag in the left arm. Active probe we, we maintained from before. Uh, we got a pair of uh, SRM-6 Irians uh, left and right, and a pair of SRM-4s left and right. We've got a couple tons of Inferno ammo and a couple tons of SRM Artemis ammo, of course, with the fire control system Artemis in the head. So with the recoil on these and the um, uh, the minus chance to, to hit with the AMS, I'm hoping rounding it out with Artemis ammo and the Artemis system uh, will have initially good chances to hit, and then we'll have to, like, you know, dodge to drop uh, recoil again and then come back in and hit again so most likely what I'll try and do is synchronize the two uh, mechs the panther and the storm crow so that they're firing at the same time and then everybody pulling back for a bit and then going back in again uh, for some more fighting depend I mean it's all gonna depend on the, the battle of course right so and that's this guy here so let's see how we do today everything else remained the same nothing really changed I think I did however did we put in I think the stealth ended up getting, once it comes shows up here, uh, yeah, I adjusted it slightly. I put the double plus exchanger, I believe. Did I? I don't think I changed too much in here. I think I increased the exchanger on this to the double plus because we ha we didn't need it anywhere else. So this guy, we were having a little bit of an issue with, with heat on this thing. I mean, not much of an issue, but a little bit. So hopefully with this in there, that'll disappear, even if we get hit by weapons that are going to overheat us. And then the advanced zoom mark three should help out with uh, targeting. Uh, I think that was actually on there before. And then the Thunderbolt two pack still in this guy. Th mark zoom uh, mark two on this, so we should be fine. All right, now the mission I want to take today is uh, this guy right here. So it's a two skull battle. Uh, it's I went through all of these, and really it's the best of them. I mean, a lot of these are like. 
Um, yeah, so this is like training day, so it's helping uh, for some mech warriors, things like that. This is really the only good battle, I think, that we can take. Now, this one here is another option. It's a single heavy air asset, but I want to run all four of my mechs today, so I have to kind of go with this one. So it is two skulls against a uh, local group of brigands in the highlands. Let's go ahead and take this. We're going to go full salvage, of course. We should be able to make our financial report. I think we'll be fine. Let's bring you down here. Let's bring you down here. And I think that's it. I think we're ready to go. We've got uh, Mongoose in here. Um, I may have already spent a couple of points on our pilots. I don't think things have changed that much. Mostly gunnery, I think. I think I added a point to Jenkins. Get an extra plus one to hit here for gunnery. Uh, or I may have added it undetected. I can't, I can't remember which one it was. But uh, anyway, let's deploy and go. I think it may require more weight than that. I think we'll be fine. Command interface initiated. Well, the tooltip said there may be more of these guys than uh, what they're letting on. I got a feeling they got a, an extra lance here. I was actually hearing rotors as we were loading in. Yeah, and they're going to get reinforcements probably... Well, they might, yeah, from up here probably. They'll get some reinforcements. So I'm wondering if we should go start high and engage the guys up here first and then come down and get the guys at the bottom. I think we've had the best success with that. I mean, they can still kind of target us from down there. But at least we're up higher, you know. They don't get the height advantage on us. I think I'm going to try that. So let's do that. Let's drop... Um, hmm, how far over here can we get? Can I get back? Let's get back. Hmm, wait a minute. Can I get through there? I can. It's kind of narrow though. You know what? Let's go here. Let's hope they don't have any indirect. Let's go like this. All right. See what we're up against here. Feel pretty good about this lance, though. We're getting pretty strong. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we're getting some pretty good weapons. I'm gonna go this way. Heads up, All right. Commander. You've got hostile contacts inbound. Yeah, I knew we would. All right. So we got. So this is. Is that primary or secondary? I don't know. Hope that's not primary because it doesn't look like much. No, it's secondary. Primary's down the hill, probably. Yeah, this is the secondary lance. Warrior, J. Edgar, Fire Truck Inferno, which we do have. Quick Cell 1. A pair of double AC2s. The doubles are actually not that bad. Either they both hit, like when you fire, either they both hit or they both miss, which is kind of cool, but they have a misfire chance, which means they can actually damage the weapon. So if you if you misfire it, yeah, that's the same fire truck that we have. Warrior is AC5 warrior with 140. So we're gonna try and pull him down first. I think we'll probably be able to get him pretty quickly. Now let's hope the bottom lance is actually maxed down here. Yeah, you better back up. You know we're coming. Yes, He's like, oh fuck, they're rocking quick cell. I better get the hell out of here. That's what he's saying. We're going to move forward a little bit here. I copy. Clint's not in the best position, but if we can get early shots off on this warrior, it's a little higher than the rest of the... Uh... Yeah, we'll take this shot. Alright, we landed one laser shot. Not bad. I'm your spaniel. Alright, what are we dealing with for movement here? Not the absolute best, but not bad. Still out of range, but we're going to stay in the trees. In the trees, please. Yeah, warfare suite, protecting your buddies. Gotta love it. You know, the quick sell gear is not necessarily top of the line, but I mean, if you got like, if you got a, if you're on a budget and you need some half decent gear, it's actually not that bad. Says the guy who's supposed to be shilling this stuff to people. <laughs> It's actually just not that bad. It's fantastic. Yes, boss. That's why I use it. I use it because it's good. Not because it's cheap, but because it's good. The price point? That's just a bonus. Alright, firing. Confirmed. Yeah. Damn it. 
It's all right, man. You'll land something today. Hopefully you'll land something today. Please land something today. Oh, Urban Mech with, uh, Thumper, probably. Minimal damage on that heat. Light damage. Holding fire. Urban Lord. Wait a minute. Isn't the Urban Lord... Eight hundred. Wait, is that the, is that the heavier version? We'll find out. Waiting for orders. All right, let's get up here. I'm interested to see what my chances to hit with this thing are at this range. We need to get a targeting computer on them, though. That's only the plasma cannon. I'm gonna leave that off for now, but we'll just go. We'll go with the tag. See if we can hit them. Got it. No, nah, it's fine. The SRMs are going to wreck these vehicles, though. Oh, we got somebody else down here. Looks like a Clint, but it could be wrong. Yeah, it's a Clint 2R. All right, so not too bad. Hopefully they got something good down there. Let's see if we can get the quick sell Scorpion pieces. Be nice to have a Lance to just all quick sell guys. Okay, I'm going to get to here. We're going to target that guy. Clint's a little slow, but if we can get him in the open, he can move a little quicker up that up that walkway there. All right, so that's long-range targeting, which I think we want to stay with because it is kind of far away. I'll make him dead. You won't make him nothing. Got to get you some Rex lasers. What the? I missed, Commander. Oh, sorry. I thought there for a second he was upset at me saying we're going to get him some Rex lasers. No He's shooting. like, what the? What do you just mean? Running. No, no, no. He's just upset that he missed. That's all. All right, take a shot at this guy. Um, yeah, I don't know if we'll, I don't know if we'll be here ten turns. Let's just see if we can pull this guy down. Yes, quick sell, baby, for the win every time. Next destroyed. Uh oh. You ain't got nothing. You hear me? Waiting for orders. Okay, we're gonna work on this uh, fire truck. Get him out of here. This thing left by itself is gonna cause problems. <laughs> Let's get rid of them. Oof! Only one, only one hit, eh? All right. So there's something back over here. LRM five. Oh, what's that? Swordsman. Ah, damn it. It's a crappy lance. Orders? It's, well, not crappy, but an older lance. Move up to here. Drop some instability. Target this guy. Let's remove him. Remove him from service. One less target. Thank you for your service. Yeah, that, uh... That clip in, um... You know, it's funny, the uh, the film Nobody with Bob Odenkirk, I thought it was pretty good. Um, there's a bit of inconsistency with it, but um, that scene... What's this guy? Cataphract. Pirate. That's the uh, nasty fract. The ballistic's down, though, so that's probably really good. Standing by. Um, but I thought it was pretty good. There was a, like I said, there was a few inconsistencies inconsistencies with it uh, but overall the film was quite good except for the end I find the end they, they jump kind of jumped the shark with that last battle it's kind of the, that was more of a traditional um, kind of like 80s or yeah like late 80s kind of like hero fighting the bad guys kind of battle which to me wasn't really um, I don't know it, it didn't fit with the rest of the movie but, I mean, it was alright for the film. But that, that the scene there in the uh, tattoo parlor where they recognize his tattoo and the, the one vet guy's like, thank you for your service and then he just goes behind and bolts the door. <laughs> like, I ain't fucking with you. I know what that tattoo is. I'm not fucking with you. Minimal damage. Damage is minor, Commander. Damage is minor, but we're major. We're all up in this win. game, and we're the only big player. All right, let's get up into here.
Yeah, that uh, panther is a little too slow for my liking, but it's fine. Orders. I'm probably going to have to change my... Uh... Hmm. I'm probably going to have to change my... Um... Sorry, I, got, I can't think it. I can't do two things at once. If that's not evident already. Hmm. I'm trying to get a solid red line on this cataphract. I want to get some... Uh, some Inferno on it. Maybe we just pull down one of these quick cells. Let's go to here. Got it. We'll see what our chance to hit is. We're going to move most of the guys up. All three of them. So we can't really do much on the cataphract anyway. So let's um, switch this up. We got 10 turns of firing with each, so this should probably do some good damage. We're doing 10 damage with these? What are we doing with these? Eight? Put an extra almost 20% chance to hit. This does. It does 20% more damage with the Infernos. But then I, I, my guys are moving up. I don't want to get fire here, so let's just kill this guy this way. Engaging. Not bad. Tags on. Oof. Nice. It's a swordsman, I guess. So a swordsman, I think, has got... If it's the old version... Yeah, AC5, LRM5, SRM4. Actually, not. that's not a bad version. No armor, though. Receiving you. How are you? Affirmative. Interested to see. That's probably a kill on you, but we're in the back of this guy. I'm gonna go after this guy and see if we can take him down. On your nice. Oh hell yes. All right, Jenkins, calm down, man. He's just excited to be in the Panther after having to pilot that. Uh oh. After having to pilot that. Uh, commando for a while. I was worried that we weren't going to get out of that commando for a long time. Commander. But it's nice to see that they've added a bunch of uh, good, like, half-decent quick sell stuff, so. Alright, Clint's going to be a while before it's into combat here. We may have to back up temporarily. I think that's a plasma cannon. I think he's rocking the plasma as well. Okay, I wonder if we can kill you with the uh, vehicle. We gotta land the shots. So, do you have a rifle? Two R. Is that the rifled version? I, I can't. It doesn't have any armor anyway. But I mean, I think it's. I think it's the rifled version. I could be wrong. I have been wrong on many occasions. That's okay. I still love to play the game. Firing! Ooh, two laser hits this time. It's not in the right spot. Alright, who's up first? 14. Swordsman. Nope. Sorry, the Jader hasn't gone yet. Alright, if you have to go. If you must. Alright. We'll see if we can push now in a second here. Yes, we can. Beautiful. Okay. Full speed yes, we can. We can what? I don't know. We can. We can we can do it. That might be a kill in the vehicle. That would be guns off the field. Pretty good damage for the, or a pretty good shot in that guy. Pretty good shot in the Urban Lord. What are we looking at for armor? 879 or 897? Pair of missile launchers. I don't know if those are rockets or if those are something else. That's just the AC-5. Double two pack. Clint's got no armor. Hmm, man, I don't know. Let's go with the better chance to hit, I think. 
Actually, let's put some mines down there too. Cause fuck them. Ooh, okay, one of the X-Pulses hit. AC hit, mines hit. Load it up, baby. That's alright, that's actually pretty good spread. Now, can you get into the fight? You can. On the way. Double time. You know what fight we're taking? We need the footage. Come on, baby. Well, that was good damage. Thought for sure we would be able to steal that kill, but nope. Not today, apparently. Standing by. 5v5 still. Okay, you got 20. Let's bring you... to here. We're gonna get a shot at that Urban Lord, I think. We'll drop the 20 down in there, too. He's kind of in the middle of everybody, so... let's get that going. Copy that. Streaks? Nope, not today. It's a lot of mines, though. That Clint's gonna have a hard time. I'm out of FRM. Urban Lord's not going to be too, too bad. I guess the Swordsman. Urban Lord's not moving very far, so he's not going to be too, too bad, but... The Clint has got no armor, so... He's not in a good spot. Standing by. Uh, you need to be on the vehicle. So let's get you around... Here. On my way. And hope they don't come around that corner and just shoot you. All right, not bad. Firing full complement. Nice. Got past the armor. Commander. Hmm. Yeah, we definitely need a targeting computer in this guy. I can't remember if there's still one sitting in the store or not. Wait, did I put the multi-track? I put the multi-track on somebody. Was it you? Yeah, let's get to here. Not as nice as I would want it. But we're going to dump, I think, everything on this guy. He's got two rocket pack fives, so he doesn't have a whole lot. Although, you know, the funny thing is, is that that's actually... It's a 70 tonner. Oof, that's interesting. It's not a not a bad amount of hard points either. All right, let's just fire at them. On it. The plasma hit. All right, some of the rockets went through, but not much. Enjoy those mines, Bubba. Twenty of them went off. Now, I'm glad his ballistics not working because if I remember correctly, I can't remember if that's an AC-20 or an ult. Like, it's something big. I remember that. Did you run? I think you ran. Why do I feel like I'm getting lucky with this Urban Lord? Like I think there's probably a worse version. Yeah, right into the minefield. Goodbye. Nope, not enough. All right. That really hurts. That's not good. I don't like that. That's not right. That's not right. Okay. Not that great in the cataphract. I think I want to pull the cataphract apart. No problem. So let's just try and smoke this guy this turn. I'm going to throw the Thunderbolt on, why not? Uh, wait, we want to change to short range, probably. See, I'm, re I'm learning, I'm remembering a little bit. So the X-Pulses aren't that great, but the Thunderbolt, thunderbolt goes up a bit. Yes! Ooh, I think everything hit. That's nice percentage shots. Yeah, he's not going anywhere. Let's do this. Let's do this. I need you shooting that vehicle. 
Why can't you see the vehicle? Where the hell is he? He's way over there, eh? Let's get up here. No shooting, just running. Get that evasion going for you. We'll keep everybody else uh, occupied. You just kill that vehicle. It's your job today. Should you choose to accept it? Copy that. Yes. You need, a, you need a new target. You need a new target! Stealthy mech is stealthy. I've still got a uh, chameleon system I haven't implemented on anybody yet. So that'll be interesting when that happens. I don't know if I really want to close with the uh, the, the pirate. Uh, I think the, the ca I'm pretty sure the pirate cataphract has got melee stuff on it too. I can't get too close. I'm happy shooting from back here though. Let's just back up a little bit. I'm okay from back here. Got we got good tone. Let's take the shot. Oof, is it the Clint that took a lot of damage? Critical hit, Commander. Yeah, but on who? Was it the Clint or was it the other guy? Let's get you over here, get some evasion going, get in the trees. Kirby Lord, let's get try and get rid of this guy. Ooh, good hits, man. Oh, see ya! How's your crit? Goodbye. How oh, it's your 2,000. Yeah, you run. Yeah, I wish I could remember what that auto, what the auto cannon on that thing is. It might be like a pirate rack two or a pirate rack five or something crazy like that as well. Okay, we got one of three. Consciousness. Let's just move here. Position confirmed. We just can't get shot in the head. That's all. Um, let's leave this guy off for now. Drop a little bit of heat so we can get some more movement next turn. We'll do some damage to this guy. Locked on target. Yes. Rex laser, baby. Ooh, two groin shots, too. <laughs> That's what I think of you, buddy. <laughs> Commander. You might as well punch me in the dick. Well, there you go. You're welcome. All right, see what you're up to. 29 there. It's actually not bad in the swordsman. It's a back shot too. It's a little bit lower on the back. Let's take a shot at him. Here we go. All right, we got to land with one laser. Not bad. Right here. We got good tone. Turn the Thunderbolt off, but we'll use the rest at close range, or short range. Really? Really? He's got a lot of damage reduction too in that guy. At least I'm not bleeding out here. Let's get over here. Acknowledged. Alright. Do that. Fire everything. Fire everything! So he's got ER medium pirate lasers. Oh, the AC-10 spiky. That's what he had. PPZ. Right, so the, the AC-10 spiky, from what I remember, does extra melee damage. In all Oof. Heavy hits, baby. Waiting for orders. Quick sell heavy hits, baby. I think you're going to be safe there. Let's get up to here. Now, I don't know how I want to pull this guy down, though. I think we just got to keep shooting him because I, I don't... We still don't have quite as good um, targeting as I'd like to be able to start pulling legs and stuff. I got to just get lucky. Oof, nice shot. Clint v. Clint, baby. He's calling you out. Ready for orders. He's calling you out, dude. Hmm. 
Hmm. Some pretty good chance to hit on that clint. Uh, he'll, he'll probably burn his legs out. Ooh, you know, I don't know. Uh, no, I was going to say, we might be able to kill the swordsman, but I don't think we're... Oh, that's actually not bad. I'm taking that shot. I think that that could be a kill shot if we get lucky here with enough of missiles. Target locked on enemy hit. Well, good damage. Just not clustering well enough. Oh, we're affected by a searchlight. Damage is light. He, where did he move? Oof. That was good damage. We lost some Artemis ammo too. Damn, man. He hit all in the same location, I think. Yeah, pretty much. He fired everything in one location. Ready for order. Can I, you get in front of that guy? Yeah, you can. Nice. Coordinates received. Get a little bit of a meat shield going. Let's continue on the cataphract, I think. Hmm, do we want to try and kill this Clint, though? Nah, he's going to lose his own legs, though. Probably. Let's continue the damage on this guy if we can. Alright, good shots. Prototype double heat sink explosion. Now, where do we pen? See, that's wrong. We penned at... We're shooting from the right side. Yeah, see? We're shooting from the right side, and we hit the left torso. Something's messed up here. I'm finding the same thing when they're on the ground. I'm, I'm hitting the opposite side from the side I'm targeting. Receiving you. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm going insane. Maybe I'm already there. Move order received. I mean, there's probably a good to fair chance I'm in, actually in an insane asyl asylum and not actually playing this game. Oh shit, I'm moving the wrong... God damn it, this was a bad idea. Oh, that was my fault. Oh, shoot. Inferno's not gonna Inferno's not gonna help us. Affirmative. That was stupid. I thought I was moving the stealth. Inflicted some heavy damage. Well at least he didn't choose to shoot the uh That was lucky. Take much more of this. Yeah, I thought I was moving the stealth when I did that. Yes. That's okay. They're going to go before me next turn, and then it's going to be uh, an issue anyway. Ready for orders. I can't even get in front of them. But we can't move over here. Position confirmed. We'll get on the right side of this guy. Oh, we're shooting him from the front. That's probably why. Okay. Fair enough. I probably misread that. Engaging thought we were shooting from this side. Saw the connection on that one. Yes, Commander. It's me, E. Location confirmed. Same target, please. Primitive. Oh yeah, man. Receiving you. Got it. Cataphract, please. Cataphract, please. Got it. Receiving you. Give me, give me some solid tone here. Mm, let's see if we can get him in a thunderbolt range here. That's actually not bad. Let's do that. Got it. I want to try and bring him down before. Uh, Shit, should I um, do an offensive push on this guy? He's going to go next. I got to. I got to push him back. Hopefully he doesn't go before my Stormcrow. Uh, let's go for the leg. I mean, we're probably not going to get it, but let's try. Leave the Thunderbolt off for now. Yeah, we pushed his initiative back five. Six. No, five. That's all right. 
good to go. You did exactly what you were supposed to do. Get over here. Save that side. We already lost some ammo. Let's not lose more. Standing by. It's me, E. It's me. Hmm. Hmm. That's uh. Roger that. Pretty good right there. Take that chance to hit. We might as well get one chevron of evasion if we can. Hopefully, we get some more grunt shots. Confirm. Nope. How's it going? Pretty damn good. Stay out of the minefield, though. Face him directly, so hopefully he hits your frontal armor. The fire truck's actually got more armor than this thing, too. Firing full complement on enemy. Wait, who did you... Shoot. So he's panicked. Looks like I hit something on the ground there. The vehicle, probably. What's up, boss? Get over here. Confirmed. Need that cataphract gone, please. Cataphract gone. Locking on target. Yeah, you're just about done, my friend. Inflicted some heavy damage. I'm glad you don't have that AC working. Ooh, nice shot. Oh boy. That's bad. Okay, we penned his internal structure anyway. Oh, I should have finished up the Clint, but... The cataphract is more important at this point. Once again, when those guys go into those walking loops, just hit the space bar. Yes, command. It pretty much ends their turn. If you didn't know that. Okay, you got that side penned anyway. That's just got... Oh, it's got pulse lasers on it. God fucking damn it. Wait, that's the wrong... Oh, for... Monk sinks! Get over here. You got Try and get some evasion and then, uh... Hopefully go before them next turn. Yep, let's try and finish this guy off. Yes, that hit? Oh, wow, really? Only two hits out of those, eh? I'm out of LRM. This guy's taking a punishing. Taking a punishing? Ready for orders. Taking a punishing amount of damage. That could kill him. Wait, is he facing me or is he facing away? He's facing me, right? Ah, oh, it's not gonna kill him then. Locking up. Good damage. He's braced there. And we took he should have taken eight per missile, he took three. You ain't got nothing. Takes a licking and keeps on ticking. Yes, Commander. Takes a licking and keeps on kicking ass. Um. No. Yes. Let's just get you down here. I'm gonna try and swing him around behind the uh, swordsman. Ready for orders. Getting some pretty good use out of my vehicles. Acknowledged. You cannot expose. I'm receiving you. You on the other hand. You know what's up. Killing the enemy, that's what's up. Yes, quick sell. Kill even the most difficult opponents. Go down. See ya. Thanks for showing up. Order. Okay, wait. So I can... No, my left side's damaged. I gotta turn my right side to him. On my way. You know, at some point I'll get my direction. No, I won't. What the hell am I talking about? Fifty some odd years later, I'm never gonna get my directions right. There goes the leg. Report critical hit. 
Yes, Commander. Was oh, that the arm or the leg? Looked like it hit the leg. I guess I should read the report rather than actually looking at the, uh... Looking at where it's shooting at. See ya. There it is, folks. Target eliminated. Mission successful. Alright, well, 506,000. We definitely needed that, but we are taking a lot of damage, so... How do we do? Two kills for the Panther. That's not bad. We got four kills on the stealth, though. Well, <laughs> I gotta start outscoring everybody else. Oh, we do have a wound, though, so out for 20 days, eh? That's not good. Now, these are precious. Alright, so, cataphract part, which I think we're gonna grab. Urban Lord, eh? This is, like, I think the first time I've ever encountered an Urban Lord. There's two quick cell scorp. We don't have any thing that's compatible with this, do we? We regular scorpion, eh? We'll go with the quick cell scorpion. It's a four six though. Oh, a pair of these. PPZ. Bonus crit hit. Stacking ECN jamming of three. So that's one more than normal. Plus or minus ten weapon damage. I don't really care about that part. Oh, everything falls off to 33%. Recoil of two. Yeah, well... Whole bunch of iffy. 240 core. Eh, not a lot here, eh? Prototype double heat, heat sinks, though. Wonder if I should just grab all of them. Incendiary AC2 ammo. Wait, who had an AC2? Was it the uh, swordsman? Probably. Alright. No SRM ammo I can replace for the one I lost. Um, double. There's no double AC2 ammo, is there? No. So those are useless. So the double ACs, I think I've mentioned this already. It's only a 5% misfire, misfire for these things, though. Mitigated by gunnery. So if you have gunnery 5, it should be 0. But then the recoil will increase that, I believe. I was fired two shots and hit or miss with hit or miss with both. So you're either doing fifty or you're not. Which isn't too too bad. I mean five tons though. I don't have the weight on anything. I should probably grab this Urban Lord piece. What does it got? Laser ballistic and three missile plus a support. Yeah, I don't think so. Quick Cell Scorpion, maybe, with a pair of double AC2s? I mean, at least we, if we run it in this thing, if they get destroyed or damaged, then, um... Doesn't matter, because it'll just get repaired. Um... It's not really the ideal thing to grab, though. I don't know, man. I just don't know. Spiked helmet's not bad. AC2 incendiary ammo. Mm -hmm. Regular SRM ammo. I'm pretty sure I already have that already, right? Yeah. Just don't need it. You know what? Okay, let, we're, we're doing quick sell stuff, so let's grab that quick sell piece. Sure, why not? Alright, we got two fire truck. I should just make a whole squadron of fire trucks. What the hell? Swordsman part, urban lord part. Okay, two warrior pieces. I think we've got warrior pieces already. So, pirate laser we'll hang on to. Fluid guns. We've got one. I'm going to hold on to those. Heavy flamers. We've got a few already. I'm going to hold on to those two as well. Medium lasers. We've got eight. So, I can sell those. SRM twos. 
will probably never get used in anything. So let's just sell them for now. The 70 can go. The 100 can probably just go. AC5 ammo and medium rifle ammo. We got three of these. So let's sell that. I know I picked up some AC5 ammo so we can get rid of that. All right, cool. All right, 85,000. Not bad. I mean, it's 13 days, but we got to wait 20 days for the main pilot to be back anyway. Eight days to the financial report. No big deal. Jenkins is out now for the part of the month. Let's bring you up so I can get you sorted around the Clint. These two don't need any work, I don't think. So yeah, it's going to be six, eight days. So right at the financial report, of course. All right, well, I'm going to end this episode here, guys. I um, hope you guys enjoyed it. When we come back next time, I might jump to a new system. Ah, uh, you know what? We'll probably just stay here. This is I mean, There's not much within half-decent jump range. Like, everything's like a good distance away, like one skull planets and stuff. So we'll stay here. It seems to be getting us half-decent missions. So we'll stay here for a bit. I want to try and get another quick sell mech before we jump out of here. But I'm going to end the episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And please go to the quick sell site and check that out. Until next time, we'll see you later. <laughs>